paper and I'll get a towel to dry you off. There we go. Come on, baby. You'll be warm again soon. I've given it all a good clean and it's working again, but I think you need to service it a little more often. Are you sure it's all right, Mike? It's giving off a burning smell or something, isn't it? Oh, oh, yeah, you're, you're right, Bromwyn. I, I hadn't noticed that before. Ah! OK, everyone, don't panic. Oh, keep calm. Oh, 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 keep calm? How can I keep calm? It's a fire! Tr try chanting, Mike. Just say, I'm keeping calm, I'm keeping calm, I'm keeping Never mind chanting. Move outside to safety, and someone call Fireman Sam! He's been jogging all day, Sam. I saw him too. Oh, well, he's not jogging now. <laughs> Shh, Elvis. He's exhausted. He sure had you two fooled, jogging all day, honestly. Heater on fire at the fish shop. Going. To, to save, save the, the baby! baby. Ah. I didn't know you had a baby. It's not a baby. It's Willie's little lamb. It was all a silly joke. It's my fault. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay, Sarah. We'll take it from here. Penny, get the breathing apparatus. Elvis, prepare the hoses. I'm going to rescue the baby. where James has gone. I've got a full signal now. But no sign of James. James! I think we'd better call the mountain rescue team. James Jones is lost in the mountains. Search and rescue mission required. James Jones is lost in the mountains. We need to launch a search and rescue mission. I'll go with Penny and Tom in Wallaby 2. Sam, you back us up in the ambulance. Roger that, Helen. We find him soon. The sun is starting to go down. Help! Help! I'm over here! It's getting dark, Tom. We need to find James fast. Roger that, Sam. Switching to thermal imaging now. Looks like we've found him. Get ready to go in, Helen. Roger that, Tom. Yeah. 
Don't worry, James. Everything is going to be all right. Are you hurt? Um, no. I don't think so. Hang on tightly, James. We're going to get you out of here. I've got him, Penny. Take us up. Roger that, Helen. Hold us steady, Tom. He's not injured, Sam, but be careful driving him back. He's had quite enough excitement for one day. Roger that, Helen. And don't worry, I'll remember the fizzy pop. Wait a minute. Bees like honey. I'm going to put some honey on my bee hotel. But that won't work, Mandy. The bees that stay in bee hotels don't eat honey. Perfect. Uh-oh. Uncle Malcolm! Uncle Malcolm! Help! Stand back, Mandy. Kids, you two get behind the car. <sighs> These fires are spreading too quickly. I'd better call the fire station. There is a wild fire near the water mill, and it's heading towards Malcolm's beehives. There's a wildfire near the water mill, and it's heading towards Malcolm's beehives. Roger that, Arnold. We're on our way. Kids, we need to keep back. What about the bees? <clears throat> we need to stop it spreading. I'll surround the fire with sticky foam. I'll call for some backup. Tom, we've got a big wildfire on our hands. We're going to need Wallaby too. Roger that, Sam. I'm on my way. Oh, one of the smaller fires is heading for the beehives. Hmm, I'd better put it out with the fire extinguisher. Don't worry, bees. I won't hurt you. You'll thank me for this. I promise. Stand back, everyone. Here comes Wallaby, too. Once and for all, there's no such thing as moon men. <gasps> It's just... Uh, Saturn. <gasps> Run! Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Better call the fire station. The moon men have caused a fire at Joe Sparks Garage. Did she say the moon men? Ellie, you and Elvis take Venus and go straight to Joe's garage. I'll pick up Penny and meet you there in Jupiter.
Elvis, you make sure everyone is safe. Roger that, Sam. Stand back, everyone! I'll shut off the power! James. So did I. And I was just trying to do my experiment. Okay, whatever you were doing, all of you, you must be really careful around high-powered laser beams. Oh, I did tell them that, Sam. What were you trying to do? We were going to aim a laser beam at the moon to measure how far away it is. But we'll never do it now. Well, why don't you try the experiment again? Joe, you set up the laser while we help to clear up your garage. Thanks, Sam. Are we safe from the moon men now? James, you're quite safe. There's no such thing as moon men. Oh, are you sure? <sighs> yes, James. Oh! Worth the white. <laughs> oh, yes. They're perfect. Oh, no. I really should have done that safety check. Quick, get the kids to safety and take cover. Hannah! This way, Hannah. has set fire to the Flood's house and surrounding area. An out-of-control Skyburner has set fire to the Flood's house and surrounding area. to the Flood's house, we'll deal with any other blazes, but we'll need Saturn to pinpoint the locations. Roger that, Sam. Launching Saturn now. There's a group of fires in the northeast woods, Sam. Roger that, Elvis. On our way. are trapped inside. We're on it. Come on, guys. Stay low and let's get you out. Let's get this fire under control. You two blast the main blaze before it spreads. I'll tackle the smaller fires. Dad! Hey! Oh, Dad! Kids, quick! 
Out of the tent! Fire! We need to call the fire station. Where's my phone? You can use mine! A flaming marshmallow has started a forest fire. Moose and the children are in danger. A flaming marshmallow has started a forest fire. Moose and the children are in danger. I'd better call Wallaby 2 for backup. She'll interview me. Let's get that fire out first, Elvis. We can worry about the interviews later. Oh, right, do. <sighs> we need to surround the area with sticky foam. Leave that to me, Sam. Ellie, you get the hoses ready. Watch that, Penny. Stand back, everyone. Here comes Wallaby, too. I don't understand. The fire was nearly out when we went to sleep. Um, it was me, Moose. I tried to toast a marshmallow all by myself, but it caught fire. Everyone loves a toasted marshmallow, James, but they can catch fire. So always make sure you toast marshmallows with an adult. OK, Uncle Sam. I'm sorry, Moose. <laughs> uh, I can't see. Ow! Oh, sorry. No, Linda! <laughs> oh no! I got tea! I got tea pen! Not old and sticky! This is taste good, but it's sticky! Well, that's not something you see every day. No, Dance! <laughs> <laughs> this just gets better and better! Joe! Where are you? I can't see a thing! Oh, ouch! Sounds like the disco started. So, which ones do you think? Yeah. Purple it is, then. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, turn the smoke machine off, Joe! <laughs> oh, I have turned it off. There's a fire at the bottom of the stairs. Oh, no. Better call the fire and rescue team. There is a fire at the Hogfish Cafe and Bronwyn is trapped upstairs, wearing her disco trousers. There's a fire at the Hoolfish Cafe and Bronwyn is trapped upstairs, wearing her disco trousers. Sam, you go with Ellie and Jupiter. I'll take Elvis and Venus too. Looks like we're all clear, Penny. Ooh, 
Roger that, Ellie. Right, Trev. You vacuum those peas up and I'll put these pockets in the freezer. <laughs> Watch the team in action. Let's go! Let's go. Let's go. Sam, you shut off the power while I tackle the fire. I'll look for Trevor. Okay, Penny, you're clear. I can't find Trevor. The smoke's too thick to see. Sam, you help Elvis while Penny puts out the rest of the blaze. I'm on it, Ellie. Trevor! 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 Can you hear us? Sam, check upstairs in Norman's room. I saw some movement. Roger that, Ellie. How am I doing for air? You're fine, Sam. Your air is at 68%. So just take it calmly and slowly. I found him, Ellie. Trevor, stay low and move towards me. OK, Sam. Now, let's get you out of here. All clear, everyone. Authentical. Ours is done too. Oh, oh, very nice. Please with that. Hurry, Dad. There's a roll rubbish. We're bound to win. But we can't win if it's not cooked. Uh, right. Let's get cooking. <laughs> Thirty seconds. Uh, OK, OK! Uh, oh. Oh, they look brilliant! Don't start without us! Nothing can stop us now! The pizzas are cooked. Now it's over to Bella for the tasting. Shall we start with uh, uh, this one? Um, Fire! Fire! But I didn't put any chilli on it. No, Bella means a real fire! Fuck! Better call the fire station. There is a fire in Ponty Panty Park and all the pizzas are in danger of burning. There's a fire in Ponty Panty Park. And all the pizzas are in danger of burning. <gasps> Not 
We need you all to move back for your own safety. Thank you. Okay, team. Looks like we've got a burning wood oven, a gas canister, and an electric microwave. I'll disconnect the microwave. And I'll keep that gas canister cool. Switching to sticky foam. Roger that, Ellie. The fire's spreading. I'm on it, Sam. It says here that when a dog doesn't listen, you just need to be firm. I tried that. I'm telling you, Nipper doesn't pay attention to anything. <sighs> How's this for firm? High five! You might as well give up, Sarah. Nipper's never going to do a high five. <gasps> Nipper! Come here! Sarah, stop! We need to get out! Mum! Dad! Better call the fire station! There is a fire at the Holfish Cafe, and Sarah is inside looking for Nipper. There's a fire at the Holfish Cafe, and Sarah's inside looking for Nipper. We need you all to move back for your own safety. Thank you. I'll find Sarah and Nipper. I'll tackle the fire. I can't see Sarah and Nipper. I'm going to check the basement. Roger that, Sam. Sarah! Sarah! I'm here, Uncle Sam! Oh, Sarah, we need to leave. And I can't find Nipper! Don't worry, Sarah, we'll find him. But right now, I have to get you out of here. The fire's out, Sam! We couldn't find Nipper anywhere. <laughs> what is it, girl? Go, show me. Shadow sniffing Nipper's toy. She's trying to find him for you. She's concerned about the smoke. Lead radar. <laughs> That's it. Follow. <laughs> what a team. <laughs> <laughs> Mandy, Norman, and Sarah are stuck on a collapsing hill near the Mountain Activity Center. Mandy, Norman, and Sarah are stuck on a collapsing hill near the Mountain Activity Center. I'm gonna need backup, Sam. I'll pick you up in high dress. I'll meet you there. <laughs>
stay calm and keep still, kids. We're on our way. Okay, Sarah, I'm just going to secure my rope. Now, I'm going to attach it to you. Okay, Norman, the ropes are secure. I'm gonna lower you down. Ready? Mm -hmm. Mandy, the gap is too big. I'll need to get to you another way. Hang on, Sam. We are coming to help. Kilo! Whoa! Come on, Hilo. Let's try this way. Sam, take this! Get ready, Mandy. I'm coming across. Kilo, this way. Ah, thanks, Sergeant Ravani, and thank you, Kilo. <laughs> it's a tie, so we still don't know who gets the helicopter ride. Oh. <sighs> The pioneers are lost in the forest. We need to launch a search and rescue mission. The pioneers are lost in the forest. We need to launch a search and rescue mission. Hmm, those forests are too thick for Venus or Hydras to get through. And it's too far by foot. So, how are we going to get to the search zone before it gets dark? Well, there is one way. <laughs> this isn't quite the helicopter ride I was hoping for. Don't worry, you two. I'll be taking it slow and easy. Roger that, Sergeant. We'll let you know if things get a bit bumpy. Don't you worry. All I need to do is climb up the tallest tree, and then I can see exactly where we are. I'm so sorry, Norman, but I'm going to need the... Here. Here I go. We're clear, Sergeant Ravani. Roger that, Sam. I'll be your eyes in the sky while you cover the ground. Don't you worry, an old pioneer never loses his blue hair! Oh, oh, oh. oh dear. <laughs> We're getting close. Granddad, hold on! That's Sarah's voice. Where's Gareth? Gareth, are you all right? I'm in a little bit of bother, Sam. Whoa. Uh, stay calm, I'm coming to get you. We found Gareth and the kids. But we're going to need helicopter backup. Copy that. Take me up. to lift down, Gareth. They certainly do, Sam. Yay! Ah! That squashed my lunch! <laughs> anyway, from here, with our eagle eyes and keen sense of observation, nothing goes unnoticed. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, we never miss a thing up here from the Tiniest boot to uh, yes, uh, Sergeant Rivani. Um, behind you. 
Who? Who? Who is he? Joe and Hannah are heading out to sea in a jet-powered hot air balloon. Joe and Hannah are heading out to sea in a jet-powered hot air balloon. Sergeant Trevani, can you see where they went? No, sir. They were flying too fast. I'll head out to sea and search the area. Ready to back you up in Wallaby 2. Sergeant Trevani, you search to the south, and Tom, you search north. Roger that, Station Officer Steele. Transmitting coordinates now. I'm going down. Grab hold of this! Ben, get Titan to Bonty Pandy Island fast, or we'll have a massive fire on our hands. On my way! But I've got no one to operate the water cannons! Leave it to me. I've got just the firefighter for the job. Penny. Nothing from up here. Oh, it's such a big area. Hey! I'm here! Over here! Over here! Hang on! I see something. What is it, Sergeant Trevani? I found him. It's James. But I can't land to rescue him. It's nesting season, and I don't want to upset the birds. Sam, can you go? Neptune won't be able to get in there. 
Roger that, Penny. Juno is made for this. Sam, there's a very grumpy bird here. Don't worry, James. We'll get you out of here in no time. Then she can have the island all to herself. Hold on, James. was that? Fire! Fire? I told you there was a dragon. That was no dragon. They dropped their candles! Right. Stay together, everyone. I'd better call the fire station. The beast of Potty Pansy Mountain has dropped a seaweed candle and started a forest fire. The beast of Potty Paddy Mountain had dropped a seaweed candle and started a forest fire. Well, who saw that coming? We're going to need to go back up. Cans. Roger that, Sam. Roger that, Sam. Stand back, everyone. One big bucket of water coming up. That is one big bucket. some seafood stir-fries. They should be here any minute. Oh, I hope mine's got a prawn on it. <laughs> like a prawn. Gentlemen of the sea. Mandy's super scooter's brakes have failed and she's got three seafood stir-fries on board, including a prawn one. Mandy's super scooter's brakes have failed and she's got three seafood stir-fries on board. Including my prawn one! Bronwyn said Mandy's heading towards the coast road, Sam. You try and catch her and we'll back you up.
stopped you! Sorry, this is all my fault. I should have made sure those brakes were fixed on better. It was my fault, Dad. You told me not to go too fast and not to go over any bumps, but I was in too much of a hurry to do my deliveries. Well, you were okay this time, Mandy. But when it comes to scooters, you must always think of safety first. We, we will. will. Ellie? Can you come and help Jody with the skiffs while we rescue Charlie and Mike? Roger that, Sam. Tell that sister of mine I'm on my way. Hang on, everyone. Ah, does this mean we're done looking for the spotted ray? Good to see you too, Mike. Take us up, Tom. Holding us steady, Sam. <sighs> Thanks, Tom. Don't worry, Charlie. Nothing that a bilge pump and a tow from Neptune can't fix. Come on, sis. I'll take you over. <clears throat> Thanks, Ellie. We just need to tow her back and you can get the hull repaired, Charlie. Oh, thanks, Penny. Spotted Ray. Well done, Norman. Oh, it's amazing. He might have wandered out into the danger zone. And the tide's coming in. I think I'd better call the police station. Mike Flood is lost in the tidal flats, and the tide is coming in. We need to launch a search and rescue. Ellie, meet me at the tidal flats. Roger that, Sam. This 
way. Now, it's your turn. You nicely. This way. No, not that way, Wooly. This way. Ah, there. All fixed. Sorry, sir, but I'm going to need Jupiter and the hovercraft. Right you are, Sam. <laughs> Keep clear, everyone! Now that's how you drive with a trailer. <laughs> Son of him yet. Ah, wait a minute. Over here! Come over here! There he is. Ellie, looks like the helicopters have found him. Ellie! Help! I'm stuck! Stay calm, Mike. We're going to get you out. Mike, I'm getting out the inflatable rescue path. Then I'm going to get you. OK, Ellie, take us in. Roger that, Sam. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Faster! Faster! Keep going, Dad! Think of the fame once we bring back the cannon! Look! The smoke coming from the Submaster! Oh, stop! It's a broken oil drum. Oh, no, we have to move away. If the soap master gets covered in sticky oil, we'll never get it clean. Stop! Your engine is on fire! The oil is coming towards us! Oh, no, we've lost power. We can't move. Better call Ocean Rescue. Will you look at that? My poor slipper. It's not the slipper it was, sir. There's a burning oil slick near Ponty Pandy Island, and Professor Pickles and his party are in peril. There's a burning oil slick near Ponty Pandy Island, and Professor Pickles and his party are in peril. Oh, that wasn't easy to say. Um, looks like you'll need Titan, Neptune, and Juno today, Sam. We're going to need that oil skimmer. I'll go and get it. We've got nowhere to go. But the oil is still spreading. It's coming towards us. And I've got my best bow tie on. And the sea life is in danger too. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. First things first, we need Neptune to tow the sub out of danger. Roger that, Sam. We need to deploy the fire retardant booms. Roger that, Penny. Now it's my turn. Let's run a ring around that oil. Away, Dad. Excellent work, team. And the skimmer will clean up any remaining foam and oil, so there'll be no risk to sea life. I can't get the volume back, Ellie. Maybe it needs more power. Mike, are you sure you should be doing that? Oh, no. Whoa there, Prince. Help! I can't hold him! Prince, stop! Come back! Come on, 
Tranquilo. We're going to need the police and the fire station for this one. Better call the rescue team. There is a fire at the Ponty Pandy Fun Run. And a horse has bolted and is heading straight for the runners. There's a fire at the Ponty Pandy Fun Run and a horse has bolted and is heading straight for the runners. That's a new one. System and decorations with Venus. I'll tackle the ground fire. Roger that, Penny. Watch out, Penny. Oh, that was close. Is everyone okay? We're okay, but what about Prince? Watch out. Prince is heading straight for the runners. Roger that, Tom. Now, uh, don't panic. We just need you to step off the course for a while. Stay calm, everyone. Just keep moving. Prince won't slow down. I need backup. I think I can help. Sergeant Ravani, see if you can get Kilo in front of Prince and then slow down. Prince will copy what Kilo does. Roger that, Lizzie. Whoa! There we go. You're safe now. It's okay, everyone. I got Prince. Right, everyone. Uh, I'm pleased to say that we can continue with the fun run. Hello? Hello? Mayday! Mayday! Here we go. You go, Hannah. Oh, no! Someone is in real danger at sea. Better call Ocean Rescue. Wait, you are Ocean Rescue. <gasps> it's Charlie's boat. Looks like it's been pulled by a riptide. Hannah and Jodie are out there today. I'd better contact Ben. Jodie and Hannah are caught in a strong riptide near the rocks at Pontypandy Point. Jodie and Hannah are caught in a strong riptide near the rocks at Pontypandy Point. Roger that, Penny. Ah. Welcome aboard. Ellie, you take Titan. Roger that, Sam. You. you go and make sure Hannah's okay. Roger that, Penny. Hannah! Grab this! Uh, oh, Ellie, 
It's so good to see you. Nice to see you too, Hannah. Is Jodie okay? I hope so. Jodie, try and swim clear of the rocks. We're coming to get you. Keep her steady, Penny. Take my hat. Uh, oh, thanks, guys. Whew. Just in time, by the looks of things. <laughs> <laughs>